Good afternoon and welcome to another edition of the Tom and Mick Show. My name is Ellen Simpson and for the first time this week, I'm joined at the desk by Emily Raybone, our girl from Gatton. Em, welcome. How are you going? Good. Thanks for having me. Pleasure. How are you feeling? Very good. Very good. Very excited this week. I think we're joined by a fellow Queenslander. So. We are certainly joined by a fellow Queenslander. Our guest on the show this week is the one and only Mr. Greg Hardgrave from Country Co at Blackwater. Welcome, Greg. Thanks for joining us. How is the season looking around Emerald at the moment? Hello, Tom and Mick. Good to be with you, fellas. The season around Emerald is uh, in March and April we receive very good rain. We were very, very dry in the Central Highlands up at Lynn. And then we, a lot of people planted, the buffer grass got going, and then in May we received nothing. But thankfully, 10 days ago, we received 20 to sort of 30 mils over a lot of the highlands, and that's uh, made the crops look very good. Other than that, the season is, uh, you'd say, fair to middling, and we're on, we're on track for a half useful winter, we hope. Greg, I believe you've got some stock in the Wiener and Yearling sale this week. Can you tell us a little bit about um, what you've got up there? Yeah, look, in Friday's Wiener and Yearling sale, I got uh, 300 Wiener steers for the uh, Emerald Pastoral College, the uh, Emerald Agricultural Training College, as they're officially called. 150 of, uh, out of Rangus cows by uh, Brahman bulls, and 150 are out of the uh, college composite cows out of brown bulls as well. A very attractive line of steers and uh, they've all been just recently weaned and they'll be up in uh, three, maybe four lots on Friday in the wean and kneeling sale. And Greg, next week you have the QATC horse sale running. Could you tell us a little bit about that one too? Well, the Ag College are offering uh, 20 geldings and 24 geldings and mares and one uh, registered one stallion. Estale West Red Acres and all the horses in this offering have, yeah, the 24 horses we offer other than the stallion the majority are either by the stallion we're offering or they're by Genuine Roy and all these horses are departed at Long Ridge except uh, Estale West Red Acres who is at Emerald and they're all under the tutelage of um, John Arnold out there who does a very good job and I'm sure there should be a lot of interest in these horses. Lastly, uh, as a fellow Queenslander, how are you feeling about the state of origin? Uh, do you think we've got it in the bag this year, or what are, you, what are your thoughts about that one? Oh, look, without a doubt. I've been waiting, Mick, actually, I've been waiting, Mick, for uh, Tom to get a call up because everyone else in New South Wales is getting a run for them. They've had wholesale changes once again. In Queensland, we love it. We just stick with the same team, do the job every year, so, you never know, Tom, you'll probably get a call up soon. Thank you. Greg, thanks so much for joining us. We'll see you, uh, see what happens on Sunday night. I'd say the Blues will have it in the bag. Mm. Don't know about that, Elle, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Anything else, Em? I don't think so. That's all? Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers.